Hey, what up, y'all? Planet of Fakes. This is my George Floyd autopsy. Yeah, autopsy video. And basically, anybody that was at my live when I spoke about this, I told people that they would basically blame it on a pre-existing health condition, and that's exactly what they did. So now let me prepare y'all for the next prediction. The second autopsy is going to co-sign the first we seen it with Kanika Jenkins. We've seen it with so many people, Eric Garner's and all that. So it just amazed me how the family did the same thing Laquan McDonald's family did. And they get a second autopsy and the, the, he goes with the first one. Because to your normal eyes, that looked like uh, suffocating, right? He got choked with his knee. Let's say he did die from a heart attack. If he wouldn't have caught that heart attack from a cop putting the knee on his neck. So the knee and the neck influenced the cardiac arrest. It's no different than me. Say as an old lady, right? And she's walking across the street. And I zoom past a red light right in front of her. She sees the car coming her way. I swerve out her way. Don't hit her, she catches a heart attack. Should I be, should I be charged with murder? Think about that. Ladies walking, I run a red light. She sees the car, thinks it's about to hit her. I swerve, dodge her. She catches a heart attack. Do I deserve to go to jail for causing her heart attack? And that's what that's the game they're playing with people right now. Let this would have been us. Let this would have been us. They tried to charge, or people wanted J.W. Ransom's friends and brother charged for him willfully jumping in a pond where he drowned in. Couldn't possibly do that. He's a grown man. But that's what they're doing here. They're trying to say, oh, let me give you another example. Let's say they would have shot him. They would have said the bullet didn't kill him. Him actually bleeding out killed him. You understand? That, that's what they're playing here. That's the game they're playing. But anyway, this is Andrew Baker. And this first person I showed you was somebody that has something terrible to say about George and Siobhan's situation. What a coincidence. His last name is Baker, too. I hope they have no relation. But this is the medical examiner. Yep, that's the medical examiner, man. That said, George... Floyd didn't die from choking. Of course, you could sever a man's spine with your knee right there. So, you know, it don't matter. If a knee in the neck caused anything to his body, that was that, man. But ain't this something, man? They got the nerve to say pre-existing conditions. Check this all types of video out. I also got um people's opinions. And I also wanted to ask y'all, how did we get the autopsy report before we get any proof that he had a counterfeit 20? People don't understand that's very important because that's the premise that they arrested him for. If they don't have a counterfeit 20, it was no reason for him to be arrested. And based on that, they could be charged with murder because they had no reason to stop him. People just be missing the big picture, man. But at the end of the day, people don't listen to me anyway. Continue doing what y'all doing. Good luck with your government. With that being said, what you heard and saw was the content. For additional content, click the link in the description. Like, follow, share, subscribe, comment. Hit the bell. Visit my community wall. And if you have time, go to www.amore-eka.com backslash TV. That's our Planet of the Face 2. We are the new umbrella. Planet of...